So we're currently setting up for DJ's uh, rehearsal dinner tonight. A lot of fun. Cute venue though, pretty quaint, cozy. Good choice. Whoever made that choice, I'm not really sure. In Wisconsin for DJ's uh, wedding weekend. I'm excited, should be a good one. Those are cookies, cannot wait to eat those. They look real good, gonna eat a lot of those. I'm plugging everything into this. So I really should be in California right now, but this morning when I went to check on my flight, I had been bumped to a later flight because they overbooked my original flight. So I'm still here in Chicago, a little unfortunate, but work day is over. We're starting the vlog in the middle of the day. No, it's, it's, the, it's the kind of the afternoon. It's four o'clock. I haven't worked out today. I actually haven't worked out in the last like five days. So I'm feeling a bit like a blob. Um, yeah, we're gonna get a little sweaty. Hair's looking, hair's looking real good. Gonna get sweaty in the, um, the home gym here at the Foch, uh, here at the Foch house. Gonna get sweaty here, then we're gonna shower up, clean, pack, do all that, then head to the airport around like six, yeah, in like two hours. Time, time to do something. I don't really know what I'm doing. Today's workout's gonna be an AMRAMP, nine minutes. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, so the reps go up. Bar facing burpees and power cleans. And then toes to bar. I'm just gonna do, I'm just gonna do like sit ups for the toes to bar, cause I, that rack is for sure too low for me. 
Might just do like bench or something for that one. First, bar facing burpees and power cleans and at mat sit ups. I'm gonna live where the green grass grows. Watch my thorn pop up in rows. Every night be tucked in close to you. Raise our kids where the good Lord's best. Point our rocking chairs towards the west. Plant our dreams where the peaceful river flows. Where the green grass grows. This was extra difficult because this bar is extra thick, so you can't really hook grip it that well. Forearms just got blown up. I don't know what you call these bars. Not an only bar. All right, all packed up. Where's Connor? Where's Connor? Where's Connor? We're gonna take Connor to the airport, okay? We can go to the airport? <gasps> we can go to the airport? I don't think she likes that word. You wanna go in the car? <laughs> You're in the car. Do you know she's been standing out in the garage ever since I thought we were in the car? No, I did not. Yeah, I took her for a walk and then she just wants the garage instead. <laughs> Finally home. I am exhausted. So I'm back. Phenomenal weekend. I had an absolute blast seeing my family. Uh, it's so rare that all my siblings are in the same place at once. I got a few clips of that and that was really cool. Got to spend a lot of quality time with my dad, which I don't get a lot of. Same with my mom. It just awesome. Like, awesome weekend. My brother's wedding was phenomenal. Lauren, his now wife, looked absolutely stunning. She's just so gorgeous. One of the few times I've probably ever seen DJ cry, but it's his wedding day, so that's a free pass. And I'm the emotional one, so seeing him cry made me cry. And then when I was up there on the altar as the best man, all I could see was all my sisters crying, so therefore I was crying even more. So it was just an endless cycle of tears. DJ and, DJ and Lauren are gone for the next, I think, three weeks in Thailand and other parts of Asia doing whatever, kind of like a mini honeymoon. DJ's working out in China and Lauren's kind of tagging along for the later part of that trip. The early part is in Thailand. They're gonna enjoy that. That should be a lot of fun. Those two are not here for three weeks. Reggie's not here for three weeks because he's in Wisconsin being watched by Lauren's parents. But yeah, that's where we're at. Um, Anything else? So it's 11.30 at night. 
I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go to bed. Still so weird that my brother's married. Seeing that ring on his finger was just, that made it really real. I mean, I've been living with them for six and uh, maybe seven months and it's been like they've been married for that long. Just seeing that ring on his finger, did that just change it all? That was so cool. I'm so damn proud of him. And uh, yeah, that's the end of this one. See you guys for the next one.